Hey man, stop trying to fight everyone. Just ask them if they want to race. Yeah, I'll pass. I left my Centenario in my other pants. Oh, look at me, I'm Nolan. I got Centenario pants. James? Nolan? I thought it was you two. Welcome to Mexico. Hey, nice to meet you. Yeah, great to meet you in the flesh. Wow. I've seen you jump cars out of planes and that thing in the sky. How does it even stay up there? Calm down, fanboy. <laughs> you know Horizon. Haley didn't tell me you were coming down. Yeah, we heard the festival was here, so we brought the whole crew down for the weekend. The J-Crew. And Nolan. <laughs> I'll look for them around the festival. Nice car, though. This yours, James? Yeah, it's mine. Sweet little personal ride with some uh, personal modifications. This is usually where someone has me the keys. Just be careful with it. I've seen you drive, too. You know what? I think I'm just gonna go with you. <laughs> Fanboy. Right, let's see what this can do. Hey, whoa, take it easy. Zach just finished fixing this thing. Uh, guys, I don't mean to alarm anyone, but we've got a dust storm blowing up along your route. <laughs> perfect. What? No, not perfect. Not perfect. Feels good. Let's see if we can find some dirt to tear up. Not too much tearing it up, though, right? <laughs> Trust me, James. Well, you're literally inside a sandstorm now, so have fun, I guess. No, Nolan, it's fine. I wanted a new paint job anyway. am I looking at? This is the uh, Hypervocho? Alejandro says it'll do over 200 miles per hour. I'm not sure how that's even possible. <laughs> Alejandro built it. That's how. Should we take it for a spin? Don't look at me, man. You're the one who gets paid to be a passenger. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. Right. Keep your speed up. I'll call the route. Road's technical ahead. That opens up. I'll call it when you can for it. Okay, right is easier, but both ways work. You decide. Here we go. Give it the beans. Okay, just let me, uh, catch my breath here. You know, I've got an idea. If you're not doing anything tomorrow, let's build a car. You up for that? Absolutely. I'll see you at the test track at dawn. At dawn? Why? I mean, tch. yeah. See you there. Hey, hey, we're at the test track. Got my coffee. You know, drop by whenever you're ready to build a car or something. On your own time. No worries. I'll be right over. Hey. Right. First step is we got to choose a donor car. What do we got, Nolan? Got a couple of options. Which do we want to work on? Remember, if you want to work on a different car later, come back here and pick it from this list. 77 Firebird, the blocker car. I swear, I love that car. So, uh, what are we thinking? You know what a car like that is bad at? Rally. So, let's fix that. <laughs> Tall order, but I'm here for it. Just hit the button to bring up the upgrade menu at any time. We're gonna swap the entire drivetrain. 
All-wheel drive is what we need to make a rally beast out of this. Check conversions for that. Done and done. Don't worry about the cost of upgrades just now. James will get that. What? Fine. We're gonna need proper suspension if we're gonna take this thing off-road. Rally suspension is what we need. That's in platform and handling. Suspension upgraded successfully. Whoop! The last piece of this puzzle is tires and wheels. You need a specific tire for this. Look in tire compound for the rally tire compound. Nice tires, my friend. That should do it for the first pass. All right, take it around the test track. So, this is the Horizon test track. Looks like there's routes for asphalt, mixed surface, and even off-road all signposted up. Nice. Is this new? <laughs> yeah, pretty new. I can't wait to bring all my other cars here. When you're ready, bring up the upgrade menu, and we'll take a look at one more important change to make to build us. Well, it used to be a Firebird. Now it's a rally car. What's next? Seems to me there's only one option as to what we do now. And that is go smash some speed targets. Hey, I've just finished setting up. Head on over when you can. I've hooked up some computer bits to the car. I need you to drive it as fast as possible along the entire route. Are you ready to put this Firebird to the test? Let's do this! <laughs> oh boy, this is a car with very little respect for the law. We've got a 6.6-liter .6 engine that will make an astonishing 200. And with that much displacement, you can do bad, bad things, right? It never got its chance to shine in the 70s, but we fixed that today. That's it, nice. We've got good average speeds and handling, but I think we need a time trial of this car. Oh, for sure, I think I know a place. I'll call you. Yo, this is the place. Get down here so we can time trial this car. I've got the route laid out and ran some numbers for the times you should be aiming for. I swear, Nolan, I'm gonna start charging the festival for all the work you're doing. <laughs> We've gotta be scientific, man. All right, jump in, let's go. Go, keep it on the road. I've put down some stuff to mark the turn off. <laughs> Is he always this excited? You have no idea. He loves rolls. Firebird is all Hirschbergs. It's biased front like the other two, but that big engine and the chassis weight make it feel lazy through the turns. There we go. You know, I think we built a pretty good car. I think we actually have to put it up against something along a rally route. There's some great roads near the old airfield. Well, that sounds like what we need. Let's meet there.
Hey, I think we found the place. It looks like it's gonna rain, though, so don't leave us hanging here. You know, for a famously fast person, you certainly are late a lot. <laughs> I'll be there shortly. Head into one of the old hangars if it starts to chuck down. Yeah, it started to rain. But that's just gonna make this an even better test. Speak for yourself, dude. I'm not riding in that through this weather. I will be driving this. James, where, where did you get that? Some Scottish guy named Alex handed me the keys. Man, I love Horizon. See you guys. Guess it's just me and you then, Nolan. Hey, boys. Like the car? <laughs> I'll call the route, you drive, let's get him. Easy right, then easy left. Asphalt to the end. Get him. Well, that's not my fault, okay? You had a pretty good driver. More like you have no idea how to handle that car. Me and Justin could do some D-list stuff. We might be able to get high and low car down here. I mean, if we're careful. This is, this is gonna be great. We'll talk soon. <laughs> 